హలో గైస్ వెల్కమ్ టు లీడ్ ఎలక్ట్రికల్ అకాడమీ సో ఏసీ సర్క్యూట్స్ అనదర్ ప్రాబ్లమ్ ఇట్ ఈస్ ఆఫ్ సిరీస్ ఆర్ఎల్సీ సర్క్యూట్ ప్రాబ్లమ్ ఇన్ ద సిరీస్ ఆర్ఎల్సీ సర్క్యూట్ ఏ కాయిల్ ఆఫ్ రెసిస్టెన్స్ టెన్ ఓమ్స్ అండ్ ఇండక్టివ్ రియాక్టెన్స్ ఆఫ్ ట్వంటీ ఓమ్స్ ఈజ్ కనెక్టెడ్ ఇన్ సిరీస్ విత్ ఏ కెపాసిటివ్ రియాక్టెన్స్ ఆఫ్ ట్వంటీ ఫైవ్ ఓమ్స్ అక్రాస్ ఏ టూ థర్టీ ఓల్స్ సిక్స్టీ హెడ్స్ సప్లై సో ఈ హాస్ ఆస్క్ టు క్యాలిక్యులేట్ ద ఫాలోయింగ్ ఇండక్టెన్స్ అండ్ కెపాసిటెన్స్ ఆఫ్ ద సర్క్యూట్ total impedance of the circuit current power factor as well as power consumed so we will see one by one first we will write the given data given data so the given data is uh, resistance he has given as 10 ohms and uh, reactance inductive reactance no inductive reactance can be represented with xl so xl value will be 20 ohms and xc xc value will be 25 ohms so voltage also he has given as 230 volts and 60 hertz supply 60 hertz supply so for this we can draw the circuit resistance and inductance as well as capacitance is connected to a voltage source voltage source so r and xl and xc and this is the voltage so for this he has asked to calculate the inductance and capacitance of the circuit as you know inductance value xl equal to xl equal to omega l omega l means 2 pi fl so the value of frequency has given as if you see frequency has given in the question as 60 hertz so 60 hertz means 2 pi into 60 into l and xl value xl value inductive reactance has given in the question no 20 ohms xl value is 20 ohms so l equal to xl by 2 pi f xl by 2 pi f xl value is 20 by 2 pi f means 2 pi into 60 so the l value will be 0 0.053 henry 0 0.053 Henry. This is the L value. He also asked to calculate the XC value. XC. The capacitance value. So for this capacitance value, we are, we are taking XC value. XC equal to 1 by omega C. C equal to 1 by omega into XC. So omega value is 2 pi F into XC. So 1 by 2 pi into 60 into XC value. XC value he has given in the question as 25 ohms. So 1 by 2 pi into 60 into 25. So if you do it in Calci, the value will be 1.06 into 10 power minus 4 farads. So this is for uh, uh, capacitance. So if you convert into micro, C value will be 1.106 micro farad. 106 micro this is the value of capacitance so next he has asked to calculate the total impedance of the circuit the total impedance of the circuit the total impedance of the circuit means z no so z equal to z equal to r plus j of xl minus xc so r value he has given in the question no 10 ohms and j of xl value is 20 and XC value is 25. So Z value equal to 10 plus J5. 10 plus J5. It is in the form of rectangular. If you convert into polar, the value of 10 plus J5 value will be, or the value will be 10 minus J5, no? So 20 minus 25, the value will be minus 5. So 10 minus J5. So the 10 minus J5 value will be 11.18. 11.18 at an angle of minus 26.56 11.18 at an angle of 26.56 ohms this is the complex impedance in the circuit next he has asked to calculate the current current value as you know current value i equal to v by z no i equal to v by z voltage he has given in the question 230 volts at an angle of zero by z value z value we have calculated it now 11.18 11.18 at an angle of minus 
0.56 minus 26.56 it is in the form of r1 by r1 pi 1 by r2 pi 2 so r1 by r2 pi 1 of minus pi 2 so 230 by 11.18 the value will be 20.57 20.57 and angle will be 26.56 angle will be 26.56 this is the i value they also ask you to calculate the power factor power factor power factor equal to power factor equal to cos pi cos pi so cos pi means cos of 26.56 cos of 26.56 the value will be 0 0.894 0 0.894 leading next they also ask you to calculate the power consumed for power consumed or active power as you know the formula is p equal to vi cos pi p equal to vi cos pi voltage value is 230 and current value is 20.57 and power factor we have calculated the power factor now 0.894 so the power consumed value will be 4229.6 watts 4229.6 watts is the active power or power consumed in the circuit so we have calculated the a l value l value is 0 0.053 henry and capacitance value is 106 microfarad and z value complex impedance value is 10 minus j5 uh, if it converts into polar form the value will be 11.18 at an angle of minus 26.56 and the current value current value is 20.57 at an angle of 26.56 and power factor also we have calculated power factor cos pi equal to 0 0.894 leading and uh, power consumed or active power value will be 4229.6 watts the, so we have calculated all the terms in the circuit in the given series rlc circuit okay thank you guys we will meet in next class thank you